Hello learners and welcome again to another interesting class for today. For today, we want to talk about animal families. You know, the same way human beings are families, animals also have families. Let's delve into more. Now, discover animals and their families and their habitats. When I mean say habitats, I'm talking about where they live, the house they live in. That is their habitat. They also make sounds. Animals all over the world have different sounds that they make. Now, when you listen to different animal sounds, you discover that each animal has its own different sounds. Even though they are all animals, they don't sound the same. Each one has a different sound that it produces. We want to understand animals a little. Now, animal families. Just the same way human beings live together with their families. Do you know animals also have families and they live together with their families? Yes, animals also have families and they live together with their families. Sometimes when you go on the road, I know most of you must have noticed chicken with so many chicks walking with it. So that is an example of an animal with its family. Now the next one, let's talk about animal homes. Their homes are their habitats. Another name for home is habitats. When it comes to animals, we don't call it home. We call it their habitats, their environment, where they live in. Different animals live in different places. Some live in holes. Some live in the jungle. Different animals live in different places. The same way human beings communicate by talking, animals also make unique sounds to communicate with each other. With this unique sound, they are able to communicate with one another. We have different types of animals. We have mammals. Mammals live in different habitats around the world. You find them in different habitats all over the world. We also have another group of animals that we call birds. Birds make beautiful sounds in their habitats. Sometimes when you wake up in the morning, you can even hear the chirping sounds. Now, animals also have a life cycle. When I say life cycle, life cycle is a process we go through to grow from the day we were born into an adult. The same way an, uh, a human being also has a life cycle. They have the stages they go through to grow up from a baby, they grow into a child, they grow into a teenager, a youth, and an adult. The same way animals also have their own transformation stages and their own life circle. Now let's move to animal charts. Now under our animal charts, you can see animals. They are young, mean they are babies, they are children. Their habitation means where they live, the environment where they live. And you know what sounds make means, the sounds that each animal make. We start with the first one, which is lion. The baby of a lion is called cub, and a lion lives in the den, and a lion roars. The next animal we want to talk about is a dog. A dog's baby is called a puppy, and a dog lives in a kennel, and dogs bark. I'm sure everybody is familiar with the sound of dogs, dogs bark. The next animal we want to talk about is a cat. The baby of a cat is called a kitten. Now, kittens, live, kittens and cats live in cage, and the sound they make is meow. And for a hen, which is the next animal we want to talk about, the baby of a hen is called chick, and the hen lives in a coop, and it makes the sound clucks, clucks. Now, the final animal we want to talk about for today is a horse. The baby of a horse is called a fur. And a horse lives in a stable. A stable is a, like a, a him built house that is mostly made with wood, not with bricks, though, for a horse to live in. And the sounds the horse makes is nay. Now, thank you for watching today's lessons. I'm glad you were able to participate and join the class. 
please always continue to join the class so you can learn more each day about different things. I'm so sure you must have learned something interesting about our animals, their young ones, their habitats, and the sound they make in today's class. Thank you all and see you again during the next class. Goodbye.